The male reproductive system of the cat is similar to that of most mammals. There is a penis which can introduce sperm inside the body of the female and the testes are kept outside the body cavity in a scrotum which in these images has been cut to reveal the testis which is the male gonad. It is here that meiosis occurs and spermatozoa are produced. From the testis, spermatozoa will pass into the highly coiled tubule known as the epididymis. This structure rests over the testis resembling a hood. Uh, it is present together with the testicular artery and vein and also nerves and wrapped in connective tissue. Once sperm mature here, they then pass into the vas deferens, which is part of the spermatic cord. The spermatic cord possessing not only this reproductive tubule, but also blood vessels, nerves, and lymphatic vessels. The veins are arranged to form a pampiniform plexus, uh, whose arrangement helps to cool arterial blood and helps lower the temperature of the testis to protect sperm production. The spermatic cord passes just deep to the skin. It is outside the pelvic body cavity. But when it reaches the inguinal canal, it then enters the pelvic body cavity. Inside, the testicular artery and vein separate, heading towards the abdominal aorta and inferior vena cava, and the vas deferens will now pass over a ureter to join the urethra within the prostate gland. 